Good evening and welcome back to another beer review. I'm Ben the Beer Lad and today I'm going to be doing Play Brew. Um, I haven't done one of them in a while. This is Chewy Gooey, a cookie dough milk stout at 6.2%. It says all that there. Apparently it's also special a uh, special edition. Um, yeah, Play Brew is one that I've kind of gone around with and they're, they're on off with me. Um, they make some good stuff but then they make some really crap stuff. I'm still trying to find some good stuff that I'll go back to, hoping it's this. Uh, this is one that I picked up from Priestown for some form of money, I can't remember how much. Um, wasn't too much. And a bit of guff on here, it says this is one of, This one's the creamy... Hold on. This one's the creamy epitome of a freshly underbaked, chewy, melty, buttery cookie dough milk stout. Full to the brim with chocolate shards um, and crumbs almost dying to come out of this thick boy. It may as well come with a glass of milk dip in. It says that there. It also says one of three. I don't know what that means yet. I still haven't figured them out. I don't know if that means they're going to make three of them. Uh, and this is the first one. I'm not sure. I've got another play brew in the fridge and it's number two out of three. But it's not this one. It's a different beer. Um, but yeah, I don't know. No other guff on here. Um, it's not vegan. So that's a shame. But yeah, oh ow, actually. It has actual cookie dough flavouring in. Interesting. Anyway, let's crack it up, shall we? And see what we've got. Oh, I'm hoping milk stout is perfect for this weather. It's currently like two degrees outside. It's freezing cold. Um so stouts tend to warm you up. I think this is hopefully a perfect drink for this weather. So, right, so we've got jet black with the slightest ruby colour right at the bottom, but a jet black beer. Um, nice, slightly tanned head, off white, cream, ta creamy tanned head, compact bubbles. It looks nice, a lot of carb clinging to the glass though. There we go. Looks nice, so let's get a smell, shall we, and see what we get. That's got a nice blend of what stuff I can smell. I can smell roasted malt straight away, but then I can smell like a sweet, milky coffee smell. Not, <clears throat> not coffee as in pure black roasted coffee, more like a... Um, a latte or a flat white or a cappuccino, sort of milky, but still has like coffee aroma around it. It's got that that kind of sweet coffeeness to it, milky sweet coffee. Lactose. Oh, that smells lovely. Let's get a mouthful of volume carb, shall we? Carbonation's light medium and it's punchy. Body is also light medium. A little let down with that. I was hoping it'd be a nice thick, creamy body. It's not. Um, it's light medium. Let's get a taste, shall we? Cheers. Ooh. Ooh. <clears throat> Actually, that's quite good. You know what, I can forget about the, the, the thick body. I'm not bothered about that now. That is packed full of flavour. Packed. Oh, it's still going. It's packed lovely. So, you've got a typical Guinnessy stouty flavour um, to begin with. Quite nice if you like Guinness stouts. Um, quite nice. Then it moves straight into this sweet, sugary, milky coffee taste again that that was on the smell that sweet milky coffee a cappuccino kind of sweetness um, and that gets starts to get bitter or bitterer or more bitter um, so it tastes more and more like a black coffee that does pardon me a milky sweet one pardon me And then it moves. <clears throat> then it moves into nice, a nice, ch 
chocolatey finish, um, which lingers for a while, and then sort of turns into this final coffee burst. Um, but you get this nice chocolate chunk, um, if you will, um, like milk chocolate, sweet, um, but not overly sweet. Not like Cadbury's milk chocolate, where it's quite you know rich and creamy and light. It's more. I'd say 60% where it's not too dark and bitter and you know like that but it's not too light like it's not too sweet it's got a nice blend of both and then it goes into this final coffee burst and then finishes with a slight dry finish but that's nice I like it it's not cookie dough though not cookie dough though which is a shame because that's what I'm here for I mean, for cookie dough, it's a nice, it's a nice stout. I don't have a problem with it. I think it's a gorgeous stout, but it's not what they're saying it is. If they were saying it was a chocolate coffee stout or um, a coffee milk stout or something like that, I'd be more than happy, and I'd be like, "Yep, that's the perfect stout. They've they've nailed it. What they're saying, but they haven't. Um, they've not nailed it." Because they are advertising cookie dough, and I can't get cookie dough. I can just get coffee and chocolate. Now, I know cookie dough sometimes has chocolate in, depending on where you go. Ben and Jerry's, their ice cream, their cookie dough ice cream does, but you can get cookie dough without, you know, chocolate. It's it's the, the actual dough that I was looking for, the the sweetness and the cookie taste, but it's not there. Um. Overall, I don't know. I'll think about it for a sec while I sort of talk and do stuff. So, um, I'm going to go away and enjoy this. I'll give it a rating in a sec. So, Play Brews Chewy, Chewy Gooey um, mil uh, Cookie Dough Milk Stout. Um, if you've had it, please let me know. Let me know what you think. If you like it. If you don't, if you've not had it, um, I'll leave a link to Play Brews website down below. On me. I got mine from Preston, uh, Priest Town, which is in Preston. Out of 10, um, flavour wise, I would give this a good solid 9. I think it is good. I think it's a brilliant stout. I think it's a brilliant drink. Um, and I want to give it a 9, but because it's not what they've advertised, I'm going to give it. Uh, I'm going to give it a seven and a half. I'm going to be cruel because I, I really wanted the cookie dough and I really wanted the cookie dough stout. They haven't delivered that at all. But they've delivered a, an equally nice stout still. A nice coffee chocolate stout, which is nice. It's just not what I asked for. But it's one of them. It's a nice beer. I'm glad I've had it. But it's also not what I asked for you're kind of weighing up it's like you don't get what you want but you still really like it or you potentially get what you want but not like it at all it's one of them i'm gonna give it a seven and a half anyway i think it's a good i think it's a really good stout it's just not what i asked for um so yeah if you've not had it i'll leave the links down below i'm giving it a seven, a seven and a half out of ten i wanted to give it higher i wanted to give it a nine but it's just not yeah, it's just not that. If they just if they just renamed it to chocolate coffee stout or some chocolate coffee milk stout, and then sold it as that, that perfect. That'd be great. But yeah. Um, so yeah. Um, if you like the video though, thumbs up, thumbs down, all that usual stuff. If you want to subscribe, consider doing so because the show must go on, etc., etc., so on and so forth. And I'll see you later.